welcome to another episode of Financial Earning. On today's episode, we're going to be talking about Mullen's latest PR. They actually have two PRs I want to talk about. The first is going to be their card renewal for the 2025 model year for their Class 3 truck. The second PR I want to talk about is going to be Mullen's HVIP application approval, which means now they can be selling these vehicles at a $45,000 discount. So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, so in this first PR, this was Mullen's renewal of their CARB certification and CARB is California Air Resource Board. And this allows them to both sell the 2024 model as well as the 2025 model. So there will be no hiccup in terms of being able to continue to sell uh, with this specific certification. Uh, why this is important is because the state of California, along with a few other states, are really pushing a green incentive. They're trying to reduce the carbon emissions coming out of their states. And they do that by invoking specific types of air regulation uh, requirements. Uh, and again, this class three truck is now CARB certified for 2025. Uh, and it does mention at the end of this PR uh, that if Mullen was to get that HVIP uh, voucher, that you'd be able to sell this vehicle at a $45,000 discount. That does not include the $7,500 uh, federal tax uh, rebate. So just keep that in mind. So this CARB certification, I went ahead and shared the actual document as well. Mullen did provide a hyperlink in their PR for it. Uh, starting at the top, you can see this is the California Air Resource Board. You can see Mullen Automotive Inc. in the center there. And on the upper right, you can see the executive order number. I went ahead and mentioned that it is ordered that the following vehicles produced by this manufacturer are certified as zero emission vehicles. So the ZEV. Uh, and you can see the model year 2025 you can see the model name this is the three urban utility which would be their class three truck you can see zev type again they have it as the zev and then you'll see zev credit with an asterisk uh, some people have been spreading a little bit of fud i wanted to nip that in the bud right now if you look at this asterisk it says not applicable but if you did a little bit of research and you went ahead and went on to the uh, California Air Resource Board site, I went ahead and shared a hyperlink of that up in the top right. You'll actually see exactly what this ZEV credit is all about. So the credits go up until 2022. So they haven't actually started adding credits in for 2023, 2024 and beyond. And what this credit deals with is the number of vehicles sold uh, that are CARB certified vehicles. So of course, uh, Mullen Automotive's class three truck is not going to have a ZEV credit at the moment uh, but we will see based off of the latest PR if that will be changing in the next uh, few months or so all right and in today's PR Mullen announced that they did receive the HVIP uh, approval uh, to be able to start selling these at a $45,000 discount using the HVIP voucher what that means is including the federal uh, tax rebate of 7500 you can purchase one of these class 3 trucks in the state of California for under $17,000. That is huge when it comes to uh, Mullen Automotive being able to get their product out on the roads, specifically in the state of California. You should start to see some definite brand recognition in the upcoming weeks to months as these class three trucks begin to be sold. I do feel confident that you will see sales in California at this price. Another thing to think about is there is a limited supply from the latest import records that I looked at. It looked like Mullen had just produced about 240 of these vehicles, uh, subtracting the 13 that they have that st uh, stated for demos. So if you are a commercial customer looking to purchase a class three truck and you wanna be able to take advantage of this voucher program, you'd wanna purchase it now as a cabin chassis and then you'd be able to send it to an upfitter to go ahead and finish the build uh, however you'd like for your vocation. So I thought this was excellent. And Mullen again shared a link to the actual HVIP uh, notification that they received from the CARB. I'll go ahead and show that on this next slide. All right, you can see from the CARB uh, watermark at the top left, this is an email directly from the California Air Resource Board. It says, thank you for your participation. It says your vehicle eligibility application has been reviewed by the staff and they have determined that the vehicle and model identified are eligible for HVIP. So they will be able to get this voucher uh, at $45,000 discount per vehicle in the state of California. So the next, uh, 
update or the next thing in Mullen's timeline is going to be getting an HVIP dealer to be able to distribute their vehicles in the state of California. You can look up HVIP dealers on the California Air Resource Board website or you can go directly to the HVIP website and find that information. I did share the hyperlink for this uh, specific email which Mullen had in their PR, but I just wanted to show it all to you as well. So again, uh, this is excellent news in my opinion for Mullen as a company. They're going to be able to start getting their product out on the streets and I'm looking forward to the next update from them. All right, and my final thoughts, uh, again, there was an FTZ application that Mullen put in. I did do some research myself. I ended up contacting the Foreign Trade Zone Commission myself, and they did confirm that Mullen does have this application pending for their review. So again, as Mullen sells these Class 3 trucks and needs to get additional uh, components, additional cabin chassis frames from overseas, they're gonna be able to do this Hopefully with the FTZ in place, they're going to be able to scale up a lot quicker because now the cost for those import taxes, the cost for those tariffs, they are now going to be deferred until the sale of the vehicles if Mullen has that FTZ status. So that's going to be huge. It's going to allow Mullen to, again, purchase some additional vehicles with the cash on hand uh, to be able to continue the, the supply of these vehicles, specifically in the state of California with this HVIP voucher program. And with all that being said, I want to thank you for watching this video. If you found it uh, beneficial, please consider liking. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. If you like this video and you want to give me some feedback, leave me a comment. If you want to hear about other aspects of Mullen Automotive, please drop that in the comments as well. And again, I want to mention that I do not work for Mullen. I am just an overly enthusiastic investor. I do hold a position in Mullen. None of this is financial advice. This is just to give you an update on Mullen's overall status as a company and the latest in current events. And with that said, I hope you all have a great rest of the day and I'll see you on the next one.